Good morning, my name is Dave Schacht. I'm the PGA head golf professional here at Sierra Star Golf Club. Sierra Star is California's highest golf course and we're standing here on the first tee of Sierra Star with the picturesque Sherwins and Mammoth Rock in the background. And we're gonna talk a little bit about the tactics today and, and some of the things that you need to take into consideration when playing Sierra Star. First and foremost, it, it's our elevations. So what we always tell our guests is if you flight the golf ball higher, you have to, to use less club, sometimes a, a club less, sometimes a club and a half, because a ball that's hit high in the air will just stay there longer because of the 8,000 foot elevation. The second hole here at Sierra Star is, is probably one of the most difficult short par threes that you'll, uh, you'll find. It's got two tiers in it and a false front, and the pin happens to be on that lower tier, which makes it very challenging. So one of the things that we want to take into consideration uh, when we're playing Sierra Star is we always want to be cognizant of where the ski area is. And right behind me you can see Lincoln Mountain, um, which is part of Mammoth Mountain Ski Area. Typically, everything is going to flow away from the ski area south toward Bishop. I like to aim toward that rock there off the tee box typically and that kind of keeps me on the right side of the green and allows me to stay on the putting surface even if I do have a little bit of spin on the golf ball. So I, I was able to execute that, left me with a short putt for birdie, which is now back up into the grain. So as, as tentative as I need to be coming down the grain, I need to be a little bit more aggressive when I putt up toward Mammoth Mountain. So I'm putting directly at Lincoln. I've got about a, I'd say a three or four inch breaking putt here that's gonna be uphill and into the grain. So I have to be aggressive with this one. The, uh, the third hole at Sierra Star is one of my absolute favorites. As, as you look behind me, you can see a very contoured green, a very long green from front to back. We've got a beach bunker and a pond on the right. I'm standing a significant amount higher than the, the green level, so it kind of makes, if you hit a shot high, you're twice as high in the air and the ball is going to float. So I'm probably about 165 yards, 70 yards to the flag, and I actually have a 9-iron. And at sea level, I would hit a 9-iron about 135, 140. So because I flight the ball, I would say a, a little higher than average, I need to take into account that that ball is going to float on me. So I've, I've got the proper club, I believe, and we'll see if we can execute this shot. I hope you've enjoyed the tour and, and a little tip and tactics on the, the first three holes here at Sierra Star. Uh, if you haven't played or if you haven't had the opportunity, we sure do invite you to come out and experience what we think is an absolutely tremendous golf course and a jewel in the Eastern Sierra. And if, if you do play Sierra Star, hopefully these three little tips uh, have been beneficial and will help you shoot lower scores. Thanks and we hope to see you here at Sierra Star soon.